Welcome back. In today's video, we're going to discuss what is Roblox Experience Guidelines and Questionnaire. First of all, what is Experience Guidelines? Basically, that is something that Roblox has just announced today. They are launching something called Experience Guidelines. So let's go and take a look, see where it is. I'm just going to go to one of my games that is public, Pebble Heaven. On this page, if you scroll down, you're going to see something new. There's a button here. It says Age Guidelines. And right now, it's, it says Not Applicable because I have not filled out the questionnaire yet. So let's take a look, see where it is. Basically, it's an age recommendation for your game. And you can specify if it's good for everyone or for 9 plus only or for 13 years old plus only. So for every game that you have made public, you're going to need to fill out a questionnaire answering the question whether it's good for all ages, 9 plus or 13 plus. And by the way, I just want to add one more thing that you need to do this by the end of this year. Because by the end of this year, if you don't, if you haven't filled out a questionnaire for a game, then they're going to assume that your game is for 13 plus. So if you want your game to be played by a younger audience, then you need to fill out the questionnaire to let them know that your game is good for all ages or for 9 plus. Otherwise, again, they're going to assume your game is for 13 plus by the end of this year. So now let's take a look at the questionnaire. To fill out the questionnaire, I'm going to go to the Roblox Creator Dashboard. The address for that is create.roblox.com forward slash creations. From here, I'm going to select the experience that I want to fill out the questionnaire for. So I'm going to select Pebble Heaven. On the left hand side here, you can see there's a link for the questionnaire. So just click on questionnaire. So here it says questionnaire has not started yet. And then you can read through all these stuff. I'm going to go down to the bottom and I'm going to click on start. Let's take a look. On the first page here, they just want to know if uh, Pebble Heaven uh, contained violence. So I'm just gonna go down here and I'm gonna say no, there is no violence in the game. Save and continue. The next question, does this experience has blood in it? I'm gonna say no. Save and continue. Does this experience contain paid random items? No. Everything is free. Save and continue. Does this experience allow users to trade items that they paid for? No, you cannot trade items. And everything is free. Save and continue. And I guess on this last page here, I'm just going to click Submit. Questionnaire completed. All right, success. Your questionnaire has been successfully submitted. The guidelines of this experience are active as shown below. The age recommendation is now visible to users on its detail page. And let's see what, what, what is the uh, recommendation. The age recommendation for my experience is for all ages and everything else is empty. You may retech the questionnaire anytime to accurately reflect the latest content in your experience. So I guess if you change your experience, then you gotta come back here and redo the questionnaire. You must come back and update your response if any of your answers change. Example, because of an experience update. Okay, so that's what we need to do. And that's it. So now let's go back to the game and let's see if it got updated yet or not. All right, so now I'm back to Roblox homepage and I'm gonna click on that game again. Pebble Heaven and I'm gonna scroll to the bottom and look at that all ages suitable for everyone so that was pretty easy right guys uh, it's not too bad it takes uh, probably a minute to do and that's all the next thing I want to find out is what if I create a new game will I will I be able to put all that in as I publish it to Roblox so let's go and take a look I'm going to go to the create menu and I'm going to create new experience. So I got up to test 21. I'm going to create test 22. 
So here I'm going to click on new and classic base plate. Let's enter something inside the game. All right, now we're going to publish it to Roblox. So it's a brand new game. Again, it's going to be test 22. Unbelievable, I have 22 games. Testing. I'm going to turn off Team Create. And I'm going to shrink down this window a little bit. So I can see the Create button. I'm going to click on Create. Looks like it's not asking me for the questionnaire. So I'm going to close this. I'm going to exit out. Let's go back to this page. I'm going to refresh it so I can see my new game. And I'm going to click on the new game here. Now let's scroll up, scroll down. And again, you see the age guidelines is, is not applicable. So every game that you, every new game that you create, you're going to have to go back to the creator dashboard and you're going to have to answer the questionnaire for every new game that you create from here on forward and all the games that you created in the past. You're going to have to do that before the end of the year. All right, guys, so that's what the new Roblox experience guidelines is all about. And that's how you fill out the questionnaire in Roblox. Thank you for watching. We'll see you again soon.